Hi, I'm Troy Lanier and I cover gear and safety at dadlabs.com. It's an online parenting community. When it comes to car crashes, head injury is a big problem for little kids. Up to two thirds of the injuries that little tykes suffer in a crash are to the head. And for children up to 12, head trauma is the most frequent cause of crash related death. And can you guess one big source of bad head impacts? It's the backside of the front seat. During an accident, the head of a child, even one who's strapped correctly into a properly installed forward-facing car seat, can hit the backside of the seat in front of him. Not good. Brytax, one of the world's most advanced makers of car seats and strollers, knows this, and that's what inspired its engineers to develop the new Brytax Revolutionary Head Safety Technology. This technology uses important laws of physics to minimize forward head lunge also known as head excursion, and to protect your child's head. Recently, Brytex met with reporters in New York to preview this new technology. At that press event, I performed a few physics experiments to demonstrate how this new Brytex technology works. We examined center of gravity, the strength of steel bars, and the impact reducing powers of staged released energy. Let's watch these science experiments and see how Brytex head safety technology manages crash forces and protects your child. First, center of gravity. One thing I want to emphasize today, and I'm glad you're writing this down because it's going to enable you to win a prize, and that is lowering the center of gravity makes things more stable. Lowering the center of gravity. So I have a hammer like this, and I'm going to be careful on this tiled floor, but I have a hammer like this. It falls over pretty easily. I can knock it over pretty easily, but if I turn it upside down, it is a lot harder to knock over. So I'm going to roll this disc downhill, and it's going to become more stable. Here we go. It's supposed to roll downhill, but it's rolling uphill. Anybody know why? How can a disc roll uphill? And here's why. The center of gravity of this disc, as we just talked about with a hammer, is higher as a result. So if I go up a little higher, and I think of the center of gravity, just for today's sake, let's think of the center of gravity actually as the hammer head. It's a little bit below it, but let's think of it as the hammer head. If I put it right here, the center of gravity is where my hand is. As it rolls uphill, look what happens the center of gravity went down. Things are more stable if the center of gravity goes down. Now, here's how Brytex lowers the seat center of gravity to improve safety. We developed our revolutionary safe cell technology. Upon impact, the safe cells are designed to compress, further lowering the center of gravity and counteracting the forces that push the seat forward, minimizing the movement of your child during a crash. Next, let's take a look at the strength of steel bars. I took some PVC pipe. PVC stands polyvinyl chloride. It's a type of plastic. And I've got it right here. This is the kind of plumbing you have in your homes or apartments. Okay, I'm gonna put it between these two ladders. And I'm gonna show you that this plastic here flexes, you know, not just because I'm super strong, but because I'm super heavy, right? So I could probably, I'm not going to, I could probably even hang on that plastic, but I'm not going to because I'm a little worried it's gonna collapse. Instead, I wanna make it stronger what I want to show you today is what happens when... Try getting this on a plane. <laughs> In fact, all this stuff, the, I was worried I wasn't going to get through security. But I did. Um, imagine what would happen if I took this plastic and then reinforced it with some steel. Reinforcing plastic with steel would be a good thing to write down. I'm going to insert it inside this plastic. And now all of a sudden, I have something that's super strong. And I can integrate, as an engineer, I can integrate steel into plastic and make it so strong that a 220 pound male of the human species could hang on it. I'm not gonna ask anybody if the audience to do this, but I'll do it myself. Watch this, ready? Feet in the air, right? Pretty strong, you got the picture? Got it? Good, okay. <laughs> Um, I could even do some really cool stuff. I could have the steel external as well as internal and integrate that into the engineering of a car seat. As you'll see here, Brytex reinforced the car seat's frame with steel bars to improve safety. We also reinforced our seats with integrated steel bars to strengthen the connection to the vehicle and reduce forward flexing during a crash. Finally, let's look at crash impact reduction. So now what I've got here is a chute and at the bottom of it is some insulation like you'd have in your home. So anyway, so I'm gonna drop this down this chute and I have at the bottom of the chute one of these pieces. 
And let's see what happens when I drop a basketball down this chute. It may go flying. You ready? I don't, I don't think it will. I'm just warning you that it may. Oh no. It was supposed to break. We broke our demo. It went right through. And now, rather than having all the force of the basketball be applied to that one piece, I'm going to put in other pieces. And I've taken these other pieces. This is the genius of this demonstration. I've taken these other pieces and I've scored them just a little bit right along there. Intentionally. This is what engineers do. They figure out what could happen if I could modify materials and place them in like that. Another scored one right here. And these are going to give. My goal is to take this that has a lot of force as it falls and divide that force among these pieces so that not all the force comes down here and it doesn't break. Ah, oh, works like a charm every time. Didn't break at all. Didn't hit the ground. And I saved that last piece. This is called staged release. Now you're probably learning my teaching style. I keep repeating it because I want you to write it down. Staged release. As you'll see here, Brytex's patented VersaTether strap absorbs forces to help keep a child safe. And for the very best head safety results, our patented energy absorbing VersaTether features a staged release tether webbing to absorb crash forces and slow your child's forward movement during a crash. And there you have it, a technology developed by Brytax engineers to help manage crash forces all around the car seat. Now if you want to see it all come together, watch this. wonderful things in the world that touch your child's face, there's one that can be terribly harmful. The front seat of a car. Head injury in car crashes is the leading cause of death for children 0 to 12. At Brytax, we're on a never-ending mission to engineer car seats to be as safe as they can possibly be, especially when it comes to head safety. All car seats must meet a government standard for safety, but where other manufacturers stop, we begin. We perform twice as many tests as required by the National Highway Transportation Safety Administration. Brytex is the leader in car seat safety. In fact, we've redesigned our whole line of convertible car seats concentrating on head safety. We lower the center of gravity. This allows your child to sit lower, which creates stability in the event of a crash. We also reinforced our seats with integrated steel bars to strengthen the connection to the vehicle and reduce forward flexing during a crash. And we developed our patent-pending, groundbreaking Safe Cell technology. Upon impact, the Safe Cells are designed to compress, further lowering the center of gravity and countering the forces that push the seat forward, minimizing the movement of your child during the crash. The result? Not only exceeding the federal standard for head excursion, but being the very best in class for head safety. And why is that so important? So that only the wonderful things in life touch your child's face. Brytex, thoughtfully designed to fit you and your child.